Hello everybody, this is Fox4 in the Charlie Echo. Welcome to the channel. And I want to show you today a little box that I bought about two years ago uh, from uh, Omaha Beach in north of France. And <clears throat> this was a bomb bomb box uh, initially that I picked up for my uh, for my uh, wife. And I uh, told my wife to keep the box because I had a little project in mind for this little box and I'm gonna show it I'm gonna show it to you sorry and it's nothing more than a small receiver so this is a 40 meter receiver that goes from uh, 7.12 uh, to uh, 7200 and uh, you can find it in the um, QRP basics the book written by uh, George Dubbs, uh, G. Free, uh, Romeo, Juliet, Victor. And I'm going to show you the book and uh, the schematics inside. And it's a very simple and very clean receiver. And uh, usually the only problem that you have with it, it's uh, the battery. Uh, it's a 9 volt project and usually the, the batteries hold for about, I don't know, a week. And after that, you're gonna have some chirp and uh, some um, distortions on receiving, and that's uh, the time to know to change the battery. Battery. Uh, I didn't opt it for a for a LED input to see uh, to see if it's uh, on or off, because that also will drain the battery. So uh, it's a nice and clean little project, and I'm gonna I'm gonna show you the book. The project is called the Buildatron Receiver simple 40 meter receiver <clears throat> and you have a build here on a piece of cardboard with every piece uh, aligned and just a flat surface and with a straight bar for uh, the 9 volt plus battery um, input and over here <clears throat> up here you have the the buildatron the receiver and the emission part, the emitter part, because this is a TX and an RX project, but I only built the receiver part. And you have here the November Echo 602 Alpha mixer, and you have the antenna input with a T50 on 6 a uh, ferrite coil with a 33 primer and a 4 secondary and this is a mixer and you have here the input of a crystal of 730 uh, sorry 7030 and this will be one oscillator and this will have the mixer will oscillate with the input frequency and you're gonna get audio output on the Lima mic 386 uh, audio chip headphones and this is the battery input for the chip and the battery input for the oscillator and uh, the mixer. Uh, the one I built the one I built is not this one it has a, a little add-on on it you can find here every part it has a VFO and in the book you can find the schematics of a simple VFO that you can input directly into the mixer and you can add a better tuning input and it also it's telling you that you can find a kit ready to buy so this is the book and you can find here the uh, emitter part and the book is like this, The QRP Basics by George Dubbs G3 RJV. <clears throat> Tuning capacitor, <clears throat> input capacitor, the NE602 Alpha, audio amplifier, on off button, 9 volt battery, and audio jack. And this is just an antenna going to my VHF, UHF vertical antenna.